Hi guys, it's Mina. Welcome back to another very special collaboration. Today we are doing the great paint switcheroo with Canelo Sirocco, Tammy Anderson, Erica Hughes, Sarah Mack, and myself. So this is gonna be really fun. The switcheroo idea is that we all kind of are known for a certain technique. So we, Canelo put some names in a hat and drew names and techniques and I got a straight pour, which I was very happy about. So we're gonna be doing a straight pour today. Make sure you check out all of their channels. I will link them in the description box for you below so you can go and watch their pour also. So very quickly, I'm gonna show you the colors I'm working with today. I have Liquitex Basics Cadmium Red. I have Liquitex Basics Cadmium Orange Deep. Liquitex Basics Yellow. Then I also have an Amsterdam Bronze. Deco Art Americana Decor Metallics in 24 karat gold, and some satin enamels from Deco Art Americana, and a little bit of Amsterdam titanium white in there. Okay, so this is a 20 by 20 uh, gallery wrapped canvas from the edge. I have taped the back and put the push pins in. We're gonna scoot that over for a second. We're gonna layer our cup. For that size canvas, we need about 16 ounces of paint, which is how much this cup holds. So we're gonna be doing a straight pour, which means everything is gonna blend. So I wanna start with, yeah, I wanna start with some red at the bottom because I do want that to go into the center. And we're gonna just kinda of do like a, a lovely gradient. Get the colors moving from dark to light. Put some of the bronze in there now. I think this is gonna be really pretty because even if it does blend, it's gonna blend beautifully in there now. Come in with the gold. I did leave the gold a little bit thicker than everything else. Just a little bit more in there. And we're going to do that again. Red. cool color, the Amsterdam bronze. It does really, really beautiful things in the pores. Yellow, white, gold again. And we're gonna end this with one big shot of red, I think. Okay, so that's pretty cool. All right, now this gold is the same as that gold, but it's a little thinner. So that's 20 by 20. And I also have a cup of white that's also thinned out for my flow extender. But this gold is a bit thinner than that one. That one's really thick. So I'm gonna pour this in the center, just a little puddle of it. To help our pour slide nice and easy. Okay. Are you ready, husband of awesomeness? I'm my last, Sam. Here we go. I'm gonna stay pretty close to the surface of the canvas because Gail has started blowing. <laughs> Here we go. We're just gonna do a straight pour. I'm keeping it very close to get those nice fingerlings. Pretty cool. Yay! All right. Hands up a little bit. I'm going to turn this so that it goes that way instead. Wow, that's really, really pretty. So I'm going to take that same thin gold that I poured the puddle of and I'm just going to go around it once. So as it spreads out, it rolls over that. I think actually that was the thick one. That's okay. All right, so that's gonna spread out and as we start to tilt, it's gonna roll over that gold and then it's probably gonna give us some pretty gold cells popping up. Let's torch this. That's really cool. Okay, we're gonna put a flow extender around there 
we're going to use that thinned out white. Actually, let's tilt this a little bit just to see if we can get it to cover that gold. A lot of gold cells are down there already. <laughs> so the idea here is that since this paint is rolling over that gold, the gold is going to be underneath it. And you notice I'm coming back to the center every time. Okay, that's pretty cool. There's a little more down there, but I'm not going to bother. All right, let's put this white around here as our flow extender. Okay. Let's see, what do I like the most? I love this part and I love that center. I really like this part here too. So let's see, let's anchor this side first. Actually, no, I want to anchor this first. So we're going to go off that way first. Roll down to that edge. Come back to the center. Back to the middle again. And we're gonna go straight down, kind of walking it side to side a little bit. Go off that side first. Let those lines really open up. Okay, let's take a look at this for a second and see what we like and what we don't like. I actually love this part here at the bottom. I'm not so crazy about that edge. I think we're going to go off this edge one more time since that's where the weight of the paint is now anyhow. That's really cool and really interesting. I don't know if I'm loving this thing or not. Maybe we'll take some more of this off and stretch that out even more. I really 
like the red. Take it back down. I'm gonna go down this way. Gills are blowing. Okay, I kind of like that. That's really cool. I like that a lot. All right, I'm going to wipe my hands off one more time and we're going to torch it again. I think we're going to be about done. So this was really fun. Be sure you guys check out their channels, Erica and Tammy and Canella and Sarah. They're such nice ladies. It's been such a pleasure getting to know them all and, and you know, really interacting with other artists and getting to know their personalities. And they're all a great bunch of people, so. All right. Kind of awesome. What do you think? Looks like a tequila sunrise to me. Ah, that's a great name for it. Tequila sunrise. I can't drink tequila though. It just kills me. <laughs> but I do like the name. Okay, Tequila Sunrise it is. So I will show you guys this one in just dry. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us. I'll see you in a bit. Okay, so this is a couple of days later and it's all dry now. This turned out so cool. There's so many things that I really, really, really love about this piece. First of all, I really like those fingerlings. So pretty and looks so three-dimensional right now with everything else that's in there that's going on. That's so cool to me. And then this part where there was like more of a straight pour. And then over here, we <laughs> got these really cool two-tone gold cells, which are just awesome. Really cool stuff happened in this piece. I really like this one. I love these lines in here. I like these colors a lot. They're very cheerful. The cadmium red, cadmium orange, cadmium yellow. I kind of lost the bronze a little bit. There's a tiny bit of it on the other side I'll show you. But these are so pretty. And then up here, this corner where we have a lot of these little cells. This is, remember at the end where I said, I'm not sure I like what's going on. Let's tilt some of that off and keep the red. Well, when we anchored the red over the corner and then stretched it back, it thinned out all that paint and opened it up for all these beautiful little cells. There's one white one in there. Let's see if I can focus on it. It's so cool. It's like this perfect ring within a ring within a ring. <laughs> Pretty cool stuff. It's the little things in life, you know? But this turned out awesome. So this is our tequila sunrise. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I sure did. I had a lot of fun with this. So now we are off to see the next pour in our great switcheroo collaboration. Thank you guys so much for being here with me. I will link everybody else's channels in the description box. Please go check out their videos because this is going to be awesome. This is such an awesome group of people and this was a lot of fun. Thanks for being with me guys. I will see you for the next one. Have a great day.